Hey guys, this, this is John from Euro Driven. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you my new car, it's a 2019 BMW X6 35i. So in this video I'm going to be showing you the interior, I'm going to do some coding to the car, and I'm going to do a Golf T mod. Let's get it. So a lot of you BMW enthusiasts will ask, why would you get the F16 BMW 35i? The new one's coming out. Yes, that's true. But honestly I wasn't, I wasn't looking for an X6, I was initially looking for a 540 the G G30 and I stumbled across this car and I saw it, it was fully loaded had the 21 inch upgraded rims mineral white every option that is available except for the Bang & Olufsen sound system so you know I'm like you know what so this might be a good car so what really sold me on this car is the interior so this interior is a Cognac ex extended Napa leather and this is what really made me fall in love with this car these green stickers are the tints I just got tinted on Friday this window's fine there's just a bubble on that window so I'm gonna get that fixed tomorrow and this interior is gorgeous really really guys this this made me want to get this car that Napa leather very smooth like if if you guys are ordering a new BMW and have the option of getting Napa leather not even the extended version just the seats leather Napa leather itself I recommend it so this car has the M55 engine it is an outdated motor for today's standards it's pushing at 300 horsepower and 295 torque well I don't plan on keeping this car stock for too long uh, I'm really interested in the M performance power kit it's because BMW covers the warranty for those kits because it's by BMW so that's why I want to get that uh, tune. So after driving this car for a few days, I noticed this car is uh, pretty uh, heavy on gas. So uh, this, right now, this is considered good. I was at 15.5 liters per every 100 kilometers. That's with city, city driving. This got to 13.9 because today and yesterday I was doing a lot of highway driving. So I was a bit confused because in the past my family had an F15 X5 not not in package and it got decent gas mileage and I noticed that car was quicker felt quick on its feet this car feels a bit heavy uh, and I checked online that, that the F15 and the F16 have the same curb weight but I don't know why this car feels slower it feels like it's asleep like this car needs a tune I wish the the last year of the X6 came with the upgraded motors the B58s like the F30 3 series so here's a shot of the the back And I really love the uh, stitch da dashboard. It really makes the car feel a little more luxury. The rear, I don't know if you can see the rear window over there. It's not that bad. A lot of people were complaining when I watched reviews. The rear visibility is horrible, can't see nothing. Honestly, it's not bad. I thought it would be worse. All right guys, so now we're gonna be coding the X6 and the first thing I wanna do is unplug the valve. So I'm gonna be using the Carly app to open the valve and from there I'm gonna unplug the wire, tape it all up so no salt or water can get in there. So this is the Carly adapter. We're, we're gonna be plugging this into the car. So now I got the Carly plugged in, we're gonna be opening the app on my phone. So first thing we're gonna be starting the car up. All right guys, so now I have the exhaust flap page. So right now I'm gonna press the button open. I'm gonna get here open up. Yep. Hear it. So I'm gonna do a few few revs with it closed.
So right now we're going to be coating the car. So the first one I like coating is the iDrive. So the one I'm going to be coating is the M Performance. And I see there's a version 2, so I don't know which one's the version version 2. So we'll, we'll check them both. Recode now. By the way guys, it's not a sponsored uh, video. I had this device before and I'm very happy with it. I do highly recommend it. So now the iDrive on black. It should show you the uh, logo of the M logo. Just gotta wait. And usually when the, the car, everything resets on the car, so don't freak out, that's normal. Oh, that's nice. Your favorite holiday songs are on 98.1. Okay. And usually it says to re to shut down the car and reset it. So it says turn off the car and turn it back on every time when you code the car. So now we're gonna try the uh, M Performance version two. Let's see that. You know what, I'm gonna go with the version one. The version one looks nicer with the track. All right guys, I just finished coding the car. Uh, it took some time, I was doing some testing because every time when, when you code the car, everything resets. So I just wanted to make sure everything was working perfectly. Thanks for watching my video. I know this was short. It was just a car channel update. I'm going to be making more of content with this car. Can't wait. Really a lot of plans for this car ahead. Thank you guys for watching. And if you guys like my videos, make sure to subscribe and like. See you on the next video.